What's going on everybody? It's J-Dog from J-Dog Collects and today I'm going to be showing you the awesome haul I got from the antique shop and also an awesome eBay purchase I just made. It's it's a really good one. It's a big book that I've been wanting for a long time and you'll see it in a minute but let's get into it. Right here it's Avengers 182. And these I've been uh, gradually picking up. They've been sitting there a while in the shop and i've been just gradually picking them up every few times i go in there because they're still sitting there i'm like why not this is 183 it's when miss marvel joins the avengers 184 when the falcon joins the avengers 185 the origin of quicksilver and scarlet witch and i got 181 it's the first appearance of roscoe simmons as captain america and then it's after Captain America became a uh, nomad, got 182 Captain America. It's not a key or anything, but I opened it up to look at it, and it's a Mark Jewelers variant. I thought that was pretty cool. It was thicker than a lot of the other ones I had. I was like, what the? And I opened it up, and I seen the blue paper. I was like, whoa. And here's 183. It's the death of Roscoe Simmons. Then Steve Rogers becomes Captain America again. And this I went to a different uh, antique shop. It's one like a couple stores down from the one I usually go to. But this was a good find. This book right here was $6. And I looked it up and it goes for $25 to $30 in this condition. This is in really good condition. There's a like light staining on the bottom. It's like really, really small. And it's really good condition book. The Weird War Tales starring the Creature Commandos number 112. It's pretty good. It's pretty cool looking cover. Everybody likes it because that Medusa cover right there. So yeah, I thought that was a pretty neat find. And then back to that other antique shop I go to. This is the it's a whole set of Hercules. One of the mini series. I got the whole set, all four books for $10. And they're all pretty high grade too, almost near mint. So I figured I could resell those. A lot of these I'm gonna resell. I'm keeping the Captain Americas though. So if anybody's interested in them Avengers, just uh, let me know. And I'll post them on the eBay and put a link to it. I got the link to it in my description, in my uh, channel bio, I think. That was number two, there's number three. And here's number four, a cool Galactus cover. All right, so the next book is the eBay purchase I was talking about. And I can't wait anymore because I'm really excited about it. So here it is. Amazing Spider-Man number 39. When uh, Peter Parker and the Green Goblin find out each other's identities. Very nice. I've been wanting this book for a long time. I've been wanting number 42. But I got this one first. I just love this cover. This is an iconic cover. And the colors really pop on it. It's about a 3.0, 3.5. And I opened it up and read it when it first came in. So, you know, I could say I've read it. And on page 15, there's a... It's ripped on the top. It's kind of a split, but it's not real bad. Like, it's not about to come off. It's just when you turn the, move the page, it'll, like, flap up and down sometimes. But... If you hold it still, like it all, it's still like it's connected. Like you can't even see it. You have to move the page for it to move. I didn't notice it at first. Then I moved the page and it kind of moved. I was like, oh. But it still, it don't take away from anything. You can still read the whole story and read everything. Like once it's flattened down, it all connects like it's not even been ripped. So it didn't bother me that bad. But yeah. Oh, well, I paid for it. I paid, the guy had it listed for 175 or best offer, and I offered 145 and then he took it, and I thought that was a really great deal. Counting shipping and everything, I paid 160 for this, and I've seen some in a little bit worse condition or about the same condition going for about 180 to 200 or 225, stuff like around that area, so I thought I got a really, really good deal on that. But yeah, I'm super happy to have this in the collection. Like I said, I've read it. So now I'm going to just keep it in the bag and 
put it on my wall. Well, let me know what you thought of the video and let me know if you have any of the same comics or let me know any recent pickups you've got that you're excited about or what your favorite comic book is, what you like to collect and all that good stuff. Just put it down in the comments. All right, I'll see you in the next one. Thank you very much. Skadoosh.